Hi, good morning. My name is Father Rayapa. I'm uh, going to talk about a book uh, I read recently titled Collapse, written by a famous author called Jared Diamond. Collapse, that is the book. In that book, I I have read that there are five simple uh, causes, he calls them five factor framework that could cause collapse, five reasons or five causes, which are first is deforestation. Just a, a mere act of cutting down a tree can uh, bring a civilization to collapse. The second one is mismanagement of soil or land. Soil is very important. In fact, uh, Theodore Roosevelt puts it so beautifully in his quote, a nation that destroys its soils destroys itself. So mismanagement of soil also can lead a civilization to collapse. And the third one is mismanagement of water. Yeah. Water management is very, very important. It's a very important resource. And people, they don't care. People, they don't uh, spare water, they think it is an unlimited resource and people waste it. And there are civilizations, they paid a heavy price. They went into oblivion. The fourth one is exploitation of natural resources to the excess, poaching or harvesting, harvesting the fish in the oceans. If you do too much, I think the oceans will be emptied and the fish stocks will be extinct. That is what's happening in the oceans. I'm afraid right now, almost 80% of the fish stocks are lost to the planet forever. Yeah. The last one is simply overpopulation. Overpopulation. When you exceed uh, the carrying capacity of the earth, I think you will disappear. So this has been the case uh, uh, in the past of our planet's history and many civilizations they have disappeared. They did at least one out of this five factor framework of collapse. Yes. Just they cut down the trees in Easter Island. They disappeared. The mismanagement of soils in Greenland Viking disappeared. The mismanagement of water, our own India, Indus Valley civilization disappeared. Overpopulation, I think, Maya civilization disappeared. The last one is Anasasi, the overexploitation of natural resources, they disappeared. So, very important trees are important. Without trees, there is no happiness. There is no future. Let us plant as, tree, as many trees as we can. Second is soil. Let us stop making brick. I am telling again, let us stop making brick using 
the topsoil. That is a sin to buy a brick. Let us find some other thing, some medium to build our houses with. Save the soil. Next comes water. Please harvest the rain water. Measure the water. Opening the tap, opening the shower, taking bath, all those days are over, over. Measure the water. One liter water, wash your face and teeth. Maybe seven liters water to take bath. All those industry which produce pipes, taps, we need to close them down, I'm afraid. Over exploitation of natural resources, sustainable living, that is what we need in India. And uh, oceans, please stop endangered fish. Fish, if they are very common, those species, I think we can catch them and use them sustainably. But I think Indian oceans are getting empty. Even the baby fish, like shark, baby sharks, are hunted by these humans. That is gross. That is sad. That is sad. The last one is overpopulation. And, uh, you know, the world population is now 7 billion. You know, every year we produce 80 million people a year. A billion and a half million a week. A quarter of a million a day. 10,000 humans an hour. Yes. Every year we produce 80 million human beings on earth. That means 800 lakh. Did you get it? 800 lakh of humans we produce every year. That means in a week how many? About 1.5 million. That means 15 lakh of people we are producing every week and a quarter of a million a day. <laughs> what is a quarter of a million? Two lakhs and fifty thousand human beings every day. Ask this ten thousand human beings an hour, an hour. Indians alone, they produce 18 million people in a year. India alone. So please, take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Just respect this five-factor framework of collapse. Don't do them. If you continue to do them, I think you want to see collapse. That is what will happen. Nature will be very happy, happy to grant you retirement, which is called collapse. Thank you and God bless.